What's going on YouTube? This your boy Antoine D9 coming back to y'all with another video. Um, in this video, this is gonna be a college football video. Um, I want to do a couple college football. I'm gonna do two. I'm gonna do this one about the LSU Tigers versus the Ole Miss Rebel game, which is Saturday. Um, and then I'm gonna come back with one about Mississippi State versus Kentucky. Uh, preview video. But this one, I'm going to talk about Ole Miss Rebel versus LSU Saturday night. Um, as you already know, or if you don't know, Ole Miss, Ole Miss Rebels is trying to shock the world this year. they number three in the country. They beat out, they shocked the world when they beat Alabama. And they, they hadn't lost the game. Um, they hadn't lost the game at all. And in this game... I don't, to be honest with you folks, I, I know the game is in Tiger Stadium. I know it's in Baton Rouge. But I expect Ole Miss to win this game. I, I really do. Um, I got Ole Miss winning this game. I, I don't see them losing. I mean, okay, the, real, the only thing, LSU do not have a stable good quarterback. They got, I think his name Brandon Jenkins, if I'm not mistaken. Um... He's not really a good of a thrower. And then they got a backup that's really a good thrower. But he's both of them freshmen. I think both of them are freshmen. Um, and, well, one of them might be a sophomore. Brandon Jenkins might be a sophomore. I'm not for sure. I know, I heard him say freshman or sophomore. But anyway, Brandon Jenkins is not a good thrower. That The other one, the backup, he's a pretty good thrower. But Ole Miss got defense, folks. If y'all had not, I don't know, but if y'all had been, not been watching Ole Miss play this year so far, um, Ole Miss got defense. That land shark defense is is they ranked high in the country. They the top defense right now in, in college football. I mean, they are bad defense. I mean, I mean, so I don't see the only way LSU gonna get going. I mean, that quarterback can make a couple throws, you know, but. That running game, if, if 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 Ole Miss can stop that running game, and had to make the quarterback throw, that's gonna be that's gonna be uh, uh, kind of bad for LSU because I mean they quarterback. I watched their quarterback. He they, the two. I watched both of them play. They starter and they backup, and both of them struggles. Both of them struggle. I mean. Uh, they, Brandon Jenkins struggled against West, West, West Constant. So, I know he going to... They won that game. They came back and won that West Constant game, but he struggled. And I, I know he's going to struggle against Ole Miss. Um, college game day going to be there in Baton Rouge for this game. It's number three ranked team Ole Miss versus ranked LSU, which is ranked 24 in the country. They just... Um, yeah, they ranked... They just got back in the rankings because they wouldn't rank. I don't think they were. They was at the, you know, they was until Mississippi State knocked them down, not beat them, and then they got unranked. And I think they just recently got back ranked. Well, they might have been stayed ranked. I ain't for sure, but I know they're number twenty four right now. But I got Ole Miss winning this game. It's a night game, and I know people say, well, you don't want to play in Tiger Stadium and all that, but. LSU just not what they was. They got young guys, freshman guys. They lost a lot of guys in the NFL. They're just not what they was. So I got the Ole Miss Rebels winning this game. Um, Bo Wallace, Bo Wallace now he he Bo Wallace ain't had an interception in four games. And I don't expect it. Well, I ain't gonna say that because that's Bo Wallace. But so far so good. He ain't had an interception. But what's really been carrying them is um uh, is that defense. So I expect them to win this game because of that defense. Right now I expect them to win the games on their defense. So there you have it, folks. I got Ole Miss Rebels winning this game against the LSU Tigers. 